welcome to my beauty channel. Yes, buhay po po siya. And um, thank you if you are still here and if you're still following me. Thank you so much despite my lack of uploads, my delinquency. You guys are still here, still following me. Okay, so in this video, I am going to swatch a lot of lipsticks bilang. You know, lipstick is life pa rin. And bilang sa bahay, pag nag-zoom, of course, lipstick is still a necessity, a makeup necessity. At least for me, and I'm sure sa maraming tao din. And in this video, I will swatch the matte and um, satin or creamy lipsticks of Spotlight Cosmetics. Ayan! So, bonggang ano to, swatch video to. So, if you want to know um, what I think about these products, what the quality is, and also yung shades, yung itsura ng mga shades nila, then please... Keep on watching. Spotlight. So, I am going to swatch this lipstick collection. So, these are the bullet lipsticks. And these are the Superstar Matte Lips and Superstar Creamy Lipstick. Ayan, dalawang variant siya. Spotlight is another brand by Everbelena and it was created in collaboration with ABS-CBN. So, yan, finally, si ABS-CBN nag-delve na sila into cosmetics through Everbelena. And this was launched sometime last year or late 2019. Basta yun, um, umabot siya sa pandemic. In fairness, ito kay Spotlight, ha, I've noticed that compared to Everbelena, um, the colors are richer, more pigmented. And I think it's because um, it's Spotlight. Eh, so, parang it's based on um, show business, on celebrity. So, I guess yun yung concept niya. You have to be on the spotlight with their bold, rich colors. Kaya ganun. But this is not to say that Everbelen and EB Advances products are not that pigmented. Parang, yun lang yung notice ko sa kanya. Basta parang more on pang everyday yung mga yun. And this one is everyday. And pwede rin for, um, you know, mga shoots, mga ano pa ba, mga place, theater place, ganun. Alright, so this is the product. So, sa packaging muna tayo. And the packaging, it's plastic. Medyo neutral naman ako dun sa packaging. Parang hindi siya like, ay, ano ba, hindi maganda or oh my god, ang ganda. Parang hindi naman ganda. Ay, it's okay. It serves its purpose. And um, the good thing pa about this is it's it's pretty sturdy naman. Ilang best ko na nabagsak to. Hindi siya nagka-crack, hindi siya nasisira. And most importantly, the lipstick is pressed well in the um, base. So, yun, hindi siya nalalaglag. Actually, walang pinagkaiba sa packaging. And if ever there is a con, that's one con lang that um, I see. The packaging is very identical for the creamy lips and for the matte lips. And if they're together in one um, tray, you don't know which is which. So, I think next time, pwedeng, I don't know, siguro silver yung isa or white i don't know something like that para lang merong ano um color cue so your makeup routine will be easier if you're using these lipsticks hindi yung parang oy san dito si creamy san dito si matte yung mga ganun all right so that's it for packaging and next would be the shade range so yung shade range niya there are about 6 per collection so you have 6 a creamy lips and 6 a matte lips and we will swatch that in a while but right now, I would like to show you lang like a quick hand swatch. So, dito tayo kay Creamy Lips in the shade Modern Girl. That is a lipstick. And let me swatch this for you here. Yeah. Alright, as you can see, it is um very creamy, very pigmented. Dalawang swipes lang yan. And I like how smooth it is. Parang it glides really smoothly. And, ayan. Dalawang ano lang yan. Dalawang swatches lang yan and pigmented na. And this is like a semi-matte lipstick because even if it has shine in it, it is very minute and from afar, ayun, medyo parang semi-matte na siya. So, this is perfect for those na, um, who like that in-between finish yung semi-matte or matte, tapos may sobrang onting hint lang ng gloss. So, perfect to sa inyo. And also, for those who have 
perpetually dry lips like me. And let us go to matte. Tingnan natin kung ano ang kanyang finish. I'm going to use the shade Medium Maven. Ayan. Dito tayo kay Medium Maven. So, eto siya. Hmm, mukha siyang parang ano, parang um, what they call that? Yung mga soft matte lipsticks. Yung mga parang powder lipsticks. So, let me swatch this for you. Ayan. Okay. So, that is Superstar Matte Lips for you. As you can see, it looks like blotted, a bit blotted. Para siyang blotted matte lipstick. And um, just like creamy lips, it is very smooth, glides on very smoothly. But it feels more matte lang. Merong on thing drag just because it's matte. But it is not the bad kind of drag wherein parang um, you feel na talagang it's really tugging on your lips. It's really more of the, the matte texture lang that's affecting it. But otherwise, it is you know, just as smooth. Magkaiba lang yung texture than creamy lips. These lipsticks have a really nice vanilla scent. So, when it comes naman to shades, um, the shades are very safe. Good for everyday. So, you have your reds, your nudes, your pinks. I just wish lang that you know they minimized on the pinks because I find that um, they're really nice. However, um, they're more for um, more medium to, to fair skin tones. And I, I hope they added more of the, you know, the trendy 90s shades. Yung mga parang burnt sienna, ano ba, terracotta, yung mga ganong shades. When it comes naman to staying power, these lipsticks, they do not say that they are very long lasting nor waterproof. However, I find that they stay on pretty well. Um, kunyari, pag kumain ka, of course, mag-fade talaga siya. Pero, if you don't eat, kung talagang nasa lips mo lang siya, I find na hindi siya yung talagang mabilis matanggal. And most importantly, it is non-drying. That's very important for me, especially for matte formulas. Um, because sobrang uncomfortable talaga pag nagda-dry yung lips. Yung masakit, nagsusugat. And that's why I would recommend the matte lipstick. But let's save that recommendation for the final verdict. Um, so far yon, maganda yung quality ng lipsticks. Very smooth, buttery, and soft, and hindi dry. Alright, so yun ang ating very quick review sa overall ni lipsticks ni Spotlight for the creamy lips and um, matte lips. Now, dito tayo sa inaabangan nyo, and that is the swatches. So, Beshies, check out the swatches of Spotlight's Creamy Lips and Matte Lips Lipstick Range. of Spotlight's Creamy Lips Lipstick and Matte Lips Lipstick. So, ano ang ating final verdict? So, one, um, this is a pretty good quality yet affordable lipstick brand. So, para sa mga mahilig sa lipsticks dyan, ayan, check out nyo tong si Spotlight. And number two, as I said, the shades are good for everyday. Maganda naman, but I wish yung mga pinks, um, they would suit morena skin tones also. Kasi as I mentioned, more for, you know, fair and medium skin types. And I'm looking forward to seeing more shades soon, specifically in the shades of, um, brown, ano ba ba, parang terracotta, burnt sienna, mga ganun. Well, maybe because these are the colors that I like at the moment. And also, in terms of quality, really nice. Um, very smooth, blends well, highly pigmented, hindi drying sa lips yun, importante yun sa akin. And at the same time, I really love the nice vanilla scent. And finally, 
pretty good staying power it doesn't um, last too long but lasts long enough for me and I am actually okay with that because I think I am way past those super waterproof lipsticks that talagang parang pag tinatanggal mo pati yung labi mo matatanggal na so yun, um, I don't want those formulas anymore because you know I want to care for my lips kasi talagang nabubugbog yung lips ko pag ganun ka sobrang ano eh hindi nung staying power ng lipstick. So, dito tayo sa shades na isa suggest ko from each range starting off with creamy lips lipstick. So, eto yung mga napili ko na shades, yung mga gusto ko. So, we're gonna start with Modern Missy, this one. Breakthrough Artist. And then finally, we have Pop Sensation. And eto naman yung isa suggest ko from the Matte Lips lipstick range. So, we have here Sultry Siren. Scream Queen, Media Maven. Alright, so kung uh, mayroon akong pagpipilian from either of the two, kung mayroon na akong pwedeng i-take home, I would go for the matte lips lipstick line just because um, sobrang gusto ko yung mga shades niya one and you know, I'm always a matte girl and these are the one of the most comfortable matte lipsticks that I have tried. So yun, um, I highly suggest Spotlight lipsticks for you. Kung mahilig ka mag lipstick, tapos on a budget ka, and at the same time, gusto mo nung um, lipstick na alam mo yung overall maganda lang yung quality niya. Specifically, um, kung gusto mo nung matte lipstick na comfortable suotin, tapos maganda yung performance, pero hindi ganun kamahal. So yeah, so that's it for our review of Spotlight's Creamy Lips and Matte Lips Lipstick. I hope you enjoyed this video. Do let me know kung na-try nyo na to and kung ano yung favorites ninyo. And if you have video requests for me, please let me know. Specifically pag makeup dito. And yeah, that's it. And thank you for watching this channel. I hope to upload more videos. I hope talaga. <laughs> And that's it. So thank you for visiting my channel, for watching this video. Please um, don't forget to click the thumbs up and the notification bell for notifications and also subscribe. And please don't forget to follow my social media accounts. Visit my blog. That's the beautyjunkie.blogspot.com. And I also have a vlog channel. So that is the Beauty Junkie Vlog. So please subscribe. I just started that channel. And that's it. I hope to see you very soon. Bye! Oh,